episode of Dandy Bebop. Bye. Bye. Okay. Um, let's see. That can go there, that can go there. So, let's try to recap. You know what? I'm not going to recap. If you guys want to know what happened so badly, go watch the other episodes. <laughs> I guess I'll put some annotations on the video. Mm -hmm. I killed your wife! <laughs> <laughs> Ah, just in time, Dinklage. I'll have a good one. Bye. <laughs> he starts off with a really smooth voice and he sounds like, ah. How do you get it up? Okay, I would like to know. Yeah. Now, see, I know about this. Yeah. Peter does. People who haven't watched this probably don't. Yeah. Okay, I hate people in this game. Why? You're terribly imprecise. Um. Hey, look, Dark Horse Courage. <laughs> you wanna see this chest that this dude brought up a ladder? That's like made out of solid rock. That's odd. It's dangerous to go alone, take this. Nice, timely reference there. I left you a wooden sword, cause you know, it was too cheap to buy you an actual one. Well, does me grab some swords? Yes. Where's this forge? In the burning passion for his wife. <laughs> adorable! Kill it. Alright, let's talk to the kids and get this game. <laughs> Moving. <laughs> Dean Clutch has a slingshot! Wow! And no one's like, dude, he has a sword too! Except for the very, very small child. He's just sitting there, he's like, he has a sword too. And everyone's like, shut up, Evo! <laughs> Nobody cares! No, oh, that guy in the middle. Oh, yeah. What's his name? Creepy? <laughs> creepy. <laughs> so we got Creepy, Girl, and Other Boy. <laughs> Those are their names. <laughs> what? That's an amazing name, Glitch. Yeah, it's called the Slingshot. Anyone can use it. I mean, not that fast. How much do you think a nerd? How much do you think it takes nerd to blow those pumpkins apart with that slingshot? The uh, slingshot's pallets are made out of the same material as Captain America's shield. Oh, that's yeah, a, a known canon fact. <laughs> <laughs> Captain America and Link live in the same universe. It has been confirmed. It has been. What area did you cover was it? America, duh, where every great thing is. I mean, seriously, I mean, you think it's in England? No, it's in a whole, it's on a whole other world. Ah, oh, fine, I'll teach you a little brat. Why am I teaching brats how to use a sword? Well, just use it to beat me up and steal my money. Or my sword! The slice. Well, you are twice the size. Yeah, but there's three of them. Yeah. And one of them's creepy. <laughs> and one of them's a girl. One of them's a girl. Check your privilege. <laughs> You're right. I'll please the stab. Oh, you messed up! There you go. You gotta get him, Rock. You gotta, you gotta train him. Gotta get him. I swing my swan! <laughs> Think that joke's old yet? Yeah. Think that joke was ever good? No. <laughs> you know the one where you jump and hit? Whoa! That little baby guy creeps the hell out of me. Why? He's so creepy! He's not. Look at him! <laughs> I feel like this is a Christian rock cover. They were all looking in different directions. <laughs> that damn monkey! Get your hands off me! You Get over here! Yeah, that's the plan of the. Oh. Get your dirty damn. No. Have you ever seen Plan of the Apes? No. Yeah, that's what I thought. No, wait, it's this. Get your damn dirty. Right, no. I messed it up. What is it? 
Get your hands off me, you damn dirty human. Okay. Fair enough. This is the original. Yeah. Onward! Bye, creepy baby person. Also, I'd like to point out this giant gorge. Wait. How did they build the bridge? I've always wondered that. How do you build a bridge over a gorge? I think you first starts out with throwing two ropes across. That means you need someone on the other side. Google it. GTS. How do you build bridges over gorges in Zelda World? Google exactly that. What's Steve's name in Zeroldal? Oh no, there's a fence in the way. Oh no, whatever are we to do? Come on, think glitch, let's do this. Can I just go in there right now? Can you get the lantern? Yeah. Okay, go get the lantern. Are you looking it up? Yeah. Mother Earth News. Oh, beautiful. Talk! I tell you what, I just bet my little pickup against a pocket knife that this thing will hold up a cement truck. What? That was Rick Compton's wager about a 14 foot log bridge he and Hoy Rose were finishing out at the Mother Earth. Okay, screw this. <laughs> Privilege. Is this game oddly colored? No. It's like very bright. I like it. Alright. It's usually really dark. It's true. See, uh, okay, so I don't know if I've said this before, but I just thought this was really stupid when I played this the first Sunday. It's giving away free lanterns but selling them oil. And then I realized I'm his only customer. Once he gives me the lantern, I'm not gonna buy another. So what he does is he charges me for the oil. Like, that's genius, actually. Yeah? So how do you get the soup to be better? You can't. You can't? No, it's not his soup. It's, um, soup from the Yetis. Yeti? What's a Yeti? Those things aren't real. Shh. They'll never know. They'll never know. One of us. One of us. Was there supposed to be something there? I don't think so. Right, group. You're wasting your lantern. <sighs> you gotta fight a monster. Shut up! This game is awesome! I know it is. You found a play wooden sword. Oh, I can't it's see Taylor. it. It's Talos. Talo? It's a it's a Talo. It's just that one kid's. It's called Talo. Talo? Talo? Don't! Better. Bad. No. Oh, Shit like that. <laughs> Put <a> honey blazing. <laughs> yeah. You should like that too. <laughs> uh, you should like that thing on fire. Kill it! Kill it with fire! Mm. Or I cannot. Okay. Light that on fire. Light that on fire. Next time on Bebop. See you later, Space Cowboys.